we are still on the efficient fuelless generator construction. I'm making this video again for the second time for more details about the efficient fuelless generator construction. How you can build and construct your own fuelless generator at home. First, I make use of a car alternator rotor, also known as amateur for this construction. I also make use of north and south pole magnet, the rotor with permanent magnets placed on it. As the rotor spins, these magnets pass by a coil, which creates a magnetic interaction. The rotor typically acts as a flywheel as well, helping maintain momentum and smooth the operation for this fuelless generator construction. For this fuelless generator construction, I also make use of a car DC motor. I use a hose to connect the magnets rotor to the DC motor. The DC motor is the heart of this fuelless generator construction. The propose of the efficient fuelless generator construction is to produce high voltage power that will be two times greater than the input power. The output power is AC, which I will be converted with a bridge rectifier. We now have DC output. So we now have DC high power to charge the drive battery and also charge other battery. This will stop the drive battery from losing its strength. As we move on with the fuelless generator construction, please like, share, and subscribe. Here I also make use of a bifolar coil. Each of the coil are 2,000 turn and 28 gauge copper wire. Both coil are connected in series connection. How bifolar coil works. A bifolar coil works by winding two wires very close together on the same core, with a current flowing in opposite directions through each wire effectively canceling out most of the external magnetic field produced, resulting in a very low inductance and making it useful for applications where minimizing magnetic, harnessing magnetic fields for energy generation. Here I also make use of a 450 volts generator capacitor. The capacitor connected to the bifolar coil output wire. So now let's measure the AC output current with multimeter. Let's see if this constructed fuelless generator can produce up to 200 volts AC current. generator produces 2019 to 2020 volt AC on a multimeter. So let's test the output with some loads. The output can be used directly, AC, or converted to DC using a rectifier for charging batteries 
or powering DC devices. This efficient, fuelless generator is designed to work day and night providing continuous electrical output, quite like our solar panel units. Here is a bridge rectifier for converting any AC current output to DC current output. When I connect the positive and negative cable from the bridge rectifier to the drive battery and the second battery for charging, the generator will speed up even more. This happening because the DC motor is now receiving a greater high current, greater than the 12 volts power supply. If you want to build and construct your own fuelless generator, use a Tesla Bevelar coil pattern so that the dry battery will not lose its strength. This will help to charge other batteries along with the driver battery by connecting both batteries in series connection. This efficient fuelless generator charges three to four batteries daily. The DC motor will get too hot when the generator runs more than seven to eight hours. So I shut it down for about one hour, then I start the process again. The high current produced by this fuelless generator it or come down to the bifolar coil. A bifolar coil means two wires wound side by side around the same core, like copper wire wrapped together. There are two main connection styles. Parallel bifolar coil, both wires wound together and connected at both ends. Lower resistance, higher current. When a magnet moves near the bifolar coil, or the coil moves near a magnet, the magnetic field cuts through the coil turns. This motion induces a voltage, EMF, according to Faraday's law of induction. This resonance is what we call free energy effect, although it's technically the result of efficient magnetic field recycling. Because of the Biffler resonance, it can generate higher output for the same input motion compared to single wire coils.
Other main parts of this efficient fuelless magnet generator. Magnets create a magnetic field. Int, coils, copper wire, where current is generated. Rotor rotating part holding the magnets. Stator stationary part holding the coils. Shaft mechanical drive. Provides motion, can come from a turbine, hand crank, or motor. How it works. One, magnets rotate around or near the copper coils. A SU, two, the magnetic field changes around the coil as the magnets move. Three, this changing magnetic field induces electric voltage in the coils. All or four, the induced voltage causes current to flow, producing electricity. This over five, the faster the rotation or stronger the magnets, the more power generated. We're building and improving a permanent magnet generator, PMG, especially for free energy or DIY experiments. Use strong, powerful magnets, N35 and 52 grade. These create powerful magnetic flux, improving generation efficiency. Ensure magnets are evenly spaced and balanced around the rotor to avoid vibration and uneven torque. Shape matters. Rectangular or arc-shaped magnets match circular rotors better than square ones. Use enamel copper wire. AWG 2230 for small generators. AWG 1620 for larger ones. More turns higher voltage, but more resistance. Try or coils, two wires wound together, for better magnetic coupling and output voltage. Core material, soft iron or ferrite cores increase magnetic induction. Maintain a small, uniform air gap between rotor magnets and stator coils, around 1 to 2 mmm. Use non-magnetic material, like aluminum or plastic, for the rotor base. Ensure perfect alignment of rotor and stator for smooth rotation. Oh, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Your support is very much appreciated. Inductor generators are an essential part of modern energy systems, offering efficient, reliable, and scalable solutions for power generation. As renewable energy sources continue to grow, these generators will play a crucial role in improving energy efficiency and sustainability.